<sighs> What's up? I don't want to waste your time, I'm not going to make this video too long, but if this video showed up in your recommended feed, you're not normal. You're different to everyone else. And you knew that. You knew in the back of your mind that you are not similar to 99% of the people out there in this world. But the good thing is that it's okay. It's okay to be different to everyone else. I certainly am. I can't relate to basically anyone my age. So it's okay to be different from others. But what's not okay is for you to play your life as if you are normal, even though you know in the back of your mind that you're not. Every single night you put your head on that pillow, you know that you are not normal. And that's completely okay. But it's not okay to act like you are normal in your everyday life. Whether that's in school or whether that's in work or whatever, it's not okay to just try and fit in with everyone else because you feel lonely because you're not normal. It's not okay to try to be normal like everyone else. I tried this for several years, and when I say several years, I mean literally half my life was spent trying to fit in with the people in my school, with the people in my year group. But I just felt off doing it. Even though I would get laughs around me, even though people thought that I was normal, that just added to the confusion. Every night I would sleep, I would like just think that this is not for me. I am not normal. And every night that I would think to myself, be like, this is not for me. The people around me are not for me. I am not normal. I would start to feel guilty about not fitting in. I would start to feel guilty about being lonely, being different to others. I'd feel bad. I'd see people on social media my age and I'd see them with like tons of friends, partying in school, doing all this shit. And I would feel so, so guilty in myself. So what do you think that led me to do? That led me to act normal again. That led me to think, okay, maybe I'll just act normal again. And then I will actually fit in. But then I feel that guilt again. I feel the guilt of knowing that I'll never fit in with the people in my year group. So then I'd try to act normal again, feel the guilt, and then try to act normal again. And I would keep on repeating the cycle over and over and over again for almost all of my life. This cycle that I was in, and that many of you might be in as well, is dangerous. It fucked with my brain so much and probably is with your brain as well. It just, it made, makes us feel that we're like in a dystopian world where everyone is different. And it honestly feels like you're just invisible to the world and nobody can see you. You're just invisible everywhere you go because you know in the back of your mind you're not normal, you're not normal. But you're continually trying to act normal. And guess what happens when you try to act normal even though you know you're not normal? Even though you know in the back of your mind that you're not normal? Guess what happens when you keep doing that? You convince your mind to not be around people who are not normal. So basically, people like you who are not normal, who don't fit in, every time you try to act normal, you convince yourself to stay away from those people to try and act as normal as you can. Even though those are the people that are the best fit for you and you try to constantly avoid them because you want to act normal and you want to fit in with everyone else. Look, it's fine to be judged by some people. It's fine if everyone doesn't like you. You don't have to make everyone else like you. You don't even like everyone else anyway. You don't like every single person in this world, do you? So why are you trying to make every single person in this world like you. Why are you trying to get their validation? That doesn't matter. What actually matters is how the people who are right for you, who you fit in with, who are actually meant for you, what matters is how they treat you. Not what everyone else thinks. It's how the people who genuinely care about you treat you. They're the type of people who will treat you well even if you don't put on this persona to try and act normal. They're the ones who treat you well for being your actual self. Not some persona that you put out to the world to try and act normal and to try and fit in. These are the people that genuinely care for you. And these are the people that you need in your life. So if you are in this cycle of trying to act normal and then getting discouraged knowing that you're not normal and then feel guilty of yourself and then repeat the cycle over and over again, this is not the way to do it. That's coming from someone who's done this for several years. You have to realize that if you're putting on a facade to get the validation of other people, they are not for you. They are not the right people for you. The right people will treat you well for you, 
for the most authentic version of yourself, not some facade that you put out to other people. This is how I got better and real friendships. I hope I helped you in this video. I hope I wasn't yapping for too long, but this is something that you desperately need to hear. Click and watch this video right here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.